Okay, got this uh, 1983 Monarch 10 double E uh, warmed up here. I think you can see that okay. And I, I just got a, uh, <laughs> a simple job to do. Uh, I'm, I'm making some uh, uh, some locks for my uh, milling machine horizontal attachment. And uh, I'm going to use some half-inch bolts. I guess you're just going to have to see it as I complete it. We're somewhere there. So I'm going to stick this in the chuck. I'm fairly tight. <laughs> this doesn't have to be very precise, that's, that's for sure. I'm going to click the control on. Control on. Make sure the speed's not too high. See, this is a spot where you don't want to turn the machine on at 4,000 because it would spit that out and spit it out pretty hard. Okay, here we go. And I'm going to chew it up here. Just like this, pretty close, but not too close. Is it getting better or worse? That's about as good as that's going to run, I think, uh, close to the head. So I'll snug it up. Yeah, they're going. I'll move that. Just let set that right there. Got a center drill and a collet chuck here. Okay, move that thing up. Pretty close. simple job there. I can uh, talk while this machine's running, I forget. I need to keep talking. Just a crazy little thing I'm doing here. I'm going to make some uh, 
little cam locks. Let's see how that slipped. <laughs> Not too bad. I'll take it down just a little bit more. good enough for that okay I'll get back on the next phase here I got uh, three more to do like that Yeah, I need to uh, drill a lubrication hole in this uh, adapter here. Okay, so I got a uh, drill bit set up, then I'll call it extension chuck. Got this on an angle plate, let's drill it. smaller drill and complete the hole and then I got it so I can thread that a quarter 28 uh, in case I want to put some kind of drip oiler in it but uh, for now I'm just going to oil it with a can. Okay around to the other side. All right 
just doing the finishing touches up on this thing. Now, those bolts that I cut off and uh, those little pieces that I eccentrically drilled, this is how, how they work. When you tighten this thing, turn the bolt here, see this little eccentric will grab the uh, inside of the bore. I'll take this off and show you just where this is going to go. We're getting... And good morning. It's another morning here. I uh, am getting close to finishing this. And it's going to be so nice just to have another thing done. Okay. So, oh, get around here somehow. Okay, this thing... Let me get a better grab on it here. Goes up in here just like that. Slides in. And those and it turn these and those little eccentrics lock it in. Now probably the factory piece was heavier and it was held in with these bolts. But this will work fine. And uh okay, so the last part is uh um boring this bushing true um with the spindle so i will be back to do that and i gotta make a couple of put three screws for extracting this thing because uh it's a, it's a pretty tight fit okay back with another video thanks for tuning in